Okay, it was something I was getting ready to say, I just forgot. But um, I wrote it down. So my first topic, I talked about um, the Omega X down. Um, clams versus fish oil. And then my other topic was, um, I was talking about what Fantasia had said, but this one, um, I wanted to tell you um, something really cool. Um, Michael Jackson has a song called um, Someone Put Your Hand Out and you have to decode it to understand what the message was saying in the song. It's really, really scary. It, it's scary. Like you will be terrified as hell. Now, the message said it was a, it was a lie. He said, um, he said, someone put your hand out because all I do is hand out. And if you decode that, you know, um, it's self-explanatory. He's basically saying that he's a giving type of person within his heart. You feel what I'm saying? Because he was just that generous type of person. You got to understand, Michael didn't have a the childhood that he thought he should have he didn't he didn't have that so um and not only that you know he was immediately um rushed into the entertainment industry at a very young age so that really did capture his most of his childhood that's why he came out with that song have you seen my childhood you see what i'm saying now listen to this for all the michael jackson fans there's another cool topic about this. He has another sentence in that song. And he says, uh -huh. if I can remember, dang, what did he say? It was really, really like a mind twister. Um, he had mentioned, um, I never tried to talk about it. It's got to sound good to me inside. I just think about it. Now, decode that. If you think about that and actually sit there and decode what he just said, he said, I'm going to say it one more time so you can hear me because it's a tongue twister and it's not, but it's kind of, um, it's something that's a person listening to that song would never even hear him say they would have to go look up the lyrics because the pitch and the tone in the song was lowered. So you really had to like, some people heard it and some people did not hear it. But um, he's basically saying that um, something that is really sensitive, deep and strong to the heart of a person or the, you know, the way that they feel about something, anything, you can't really talk about some things. That's why they tell you not to tell everybody everything. Or not only that, you can't, um, some things you just have to keep to yourself because you can't put it in words. You just have to think about it. You can only feel what you think about that situation um, rather than the other way around. So it, it's kind of weird. So if someone was to tell you something and you um, had a vision of how that was, then that's different than you not able to, you're not actually able to explain it because you have to just think about it. Now that's exactly what he was trying to say. So anything that the industry had put on Michael Jackson, like, and I mean literally, anything that they had put against him you know, everybody know Michael Jackson had talent, and he still does. I already told you guys about the message of him. You have to decode his songs, like seriously. But go listen to that. Now, I did some research, and they're saying that Someone Put Your Hand Out actually came out in two, 1992, the year I was born. And then I also did some research and said, it, the internet actually pulled out that um, it was 
um, released in 2004. So it may have just been a copy. I can't believe I haven't really dig deep that deep down into it because I'm a huge Michael fan. So definitely, if you already know it, just put a comment below on that video and let me know. Um, seriously, go listen to Someone Put Your Hand Out. That's, that's kind of cool. I was scared as crap when I heard that song. I was scared as I don't know what else. <laughs> but remember, he he scared people. Michael Jackson scares people on he scared people on purpose because they scared him. You see what I'm saying? He's been the type that showed his good side for all those years, and then when he finally reached his peak in his 20s and he started to branch out on his own, that's when he started to pretend like he was bad to put on a bad image to protect himself because they were treating him bad. That's the reason why. It's a You have to decode everything that he does. Michael Jensen is really, that's a, I'm, that's a legend. <laughs>